Dearly beloved, I greet you in the name of Jesus Christ. We have entered a new day of a new month. It's a new month, isn't it? God enabled us to pass through one whole month. God is going to be with us, protect us and guide us through even throughout this month. But we must be very careful to walk with God. When we walk with God, signs and miracles happen because He is a God of miracles. Sometimes we feel as though we are walking in a desert, wondering how we are going to overcome this problem or tackle this particular issue. We feel in our hearts we've been tackling this until last month. But what do we do this month? God is speaking to you today through His wonderful life-giving word. For thus says the Lord, You shall not see rain, nor shall you see rain. Yet that valley shall be filled with water, and this is a simple matter in the sight of the Lord. Three kings, the king of Judah, the king of Israel, and the king of Edom, along with their armies, are in a war against the Moabites. They were caught up in a desert. They wandered seven days in the desert without any water. They would have been caught up with the fear of death if they were wandering with the armies, horses and their cattle flocks for seven days without water thinking of how could we tackle this problem, how we will be delivered from etc. At that time, this word comes through God's prophet called Elisha. He says, make this valley full of ditches. For thus says the Lord, you shall not see wind, nor shall you see rain, yet the valley shall be filled with water. And this is a simple matter in the sight of the Lord. How is it possible to see water in this desert without rain? That's what a miracle is. He is the God who makes the impossible happen. Just like it was said, they made channels and the Lord filled those with water. Help them through their great trouble and delivered them. He will do it for you as well. If we look at the situation, it is definitely a desert. There is no way to escape and you might be worrying how we are going to get out of this trouble. God is also telling you, my children, it is your duty to make channels. It is my duty to fill them. Our duty is to pray, make channels called prayer. What is your need now? What are your concerns in your job, in your family, in your business? Let God know all your needs and concerns through prayer. Make this channel and the Lord God will make it happen through supernatural miracles and surely make you glad He will never let you be in fear. He will turn those things that causes you fear into blessings and goodness. It's a simple matter for the Lord. Dear Father, we believe that you are the God of miracles. Even though we see neither wind nor rain, you are the God who is mighty to fill the channels with water. Please do similar miracles for your children and make them glad. Let the situations in which they fear be changed in the name of Jesus. Please make your children glad by working miracles every day throughout this month in each and every matters. And we pray in the name of Lord Jesus, dear Father. Amen. Amen.